Hello, welcome to Jeopardy. Today we will be talking about Vanderwall Bonds. Uh, I will be asking you some questions, and if you get them right, then that's great. And if you get them wrong, you need to do some work. So, my let's get to the first questions. My first question for you is: In strength, are Vanderwall Bonds strong, medium strong, or weak? If you answered weak, you are correct. Very good job. Give yourself a high five.、Uh, my second question、uh, has to do with the properties of rocks or minerals that have Van der Waal bonds. Your choices are:、uh, are they brittle? Are they flaky? Or are they、um, consisting of cleavage? If your answer is that they are flaky, you are correct. Rocks that you can tear like flakes or pieces off, those are rocks that usually have Van der Waal bonds. Here we have the components of H two O. You might recognize them.、Uh, on over here we have O two minus and H plus. Here we have、uh, an oxygen atom and two hydrogen atoms. Here they have bonded together. As you can see, oxygen has a higher in affinity for electrons, and thus grabs the electrons of the hydrogen. And as you can see right here, oh gosh, whatever. <laughs> the、uh, the dipole is negative, and down there it's positive. As you can see right here, we have two water molecules, and the oxygen right here. Is has a dipole that is negative, and the hydrogen has a dipole that is negative, and we all know that opposites attract. So since opposites attract, we form a van. Oh gosh, Van der Waal. I can't point to it. You see it, a Van der Waal bond. And like I said earlier, these are very weak, and because these are water molecules, they're they are in solution and thus fluid. So you can imagine a bunch of these molecules going around with different dipoles, and this sort of thing right here happens all the time. And because they're weak, they separate easily and go. They just reproduce this cycle over and over again. Flaky rocks will have Van der Waal bonds in them, and it looks like this. You can just see these different bonds all over, and they connect the two. But like I said earlier, they're weak. And it's easy to just erase these and flake or pull them off. So that's been Vanderwall bonds. I hope that I have helped you a little bit.